Good afternoon, CEO, Ms. Yandan Ren, Acting President, Dr. Apitep, Assistant Presidents, Directors, Faculty, Staff, and Students, Parents, Relatives, and Friends. Welcome to Stanford International University Commencement for the Class of 2022. Congratulations to all you graduates on getting through the easiest part of your life today. I'm not gonna lecture you on what to do now that you're graduates or how to pursue your dreams if you have any. I just want to talk to you about how to be a good person and a citizen of the world. First thing I want to tell you is don't just think about yourself. You know, someday when they discover the center of the universe, don't be disappointed if it's not you. Be honest. Be honest with people you meet, friends you make. If you tell them you're going to do something, do it. If you can't do it, let them know. But be honest in your dealings. Be responsible. You know, we are in a situation where you have the ability to be a grown-up and be yourself. But be responsible. Take on anything, but make sure it's within your capability. Be kind, be kind. It's hard sometimes because you'll meet people who are difficult, people you don't agree with, but try to put yourself in their shoes and recognize that some people need help no matter what kind of attitude they have. Be polite. When you meet people for the first time, first impressions are lasting. Make sure you're polite. Always conduct yourself well so that people respect you in the, the end. Try to understand others. Many, many times we will encounter people who have different opinions. We come from different cultures, different religions, different backgrounds, different experience. But try to understand not everyone is like you. And if we all were like you, then this would be a pretty boring planet to live on. Don't devalue people. When we look at what someone has or doesn't have and we look down on them, or we might even be jealous, we can't make a value judgment unless we know them because we don't know who they are and where they come from. That leads into something really important and something that I really believe in, and that's to share what you have, whether it's knowledge, food, a joke, a stupid idea, no matter what, share. That's how we learn, that's how we grow. One important thing that I've learned is not to live in the past. Live for today, live for tomorrow. We can't do anything about the past, it's gone. So look to the future. Be flexible. Again, this goes back to maybe being kind, but be flexible because some people are immovable no matter what we try to do, no matter how good we try to be. Look past that and again, keep to the future. And the last thing I would say is to smile. Smile. It's contagious, first of all. It's good to relieve stress. Makes you look better. It also sometimes makes people wonder what you've been up to. So, how do you live now that you're going to be graduates? Well, Bruce Lee was a small man in stature, but a giant in life. He had a great theory. Empty your mind, be formless, shapeless, like water. Now you put water in a cup, it becomes a cup. You put water in a bottle, it becomes a bottle. You put water in a teapot, it becomes a teapot. Now water can flow or it can crash. It can be angry, it can be calm. Be like water. We look at a river, we look at land that it flows through, and they get along, they're harmonious different stages at different times, but it keeps moving without interruption. 
be like water. So I'm going to close with some words of wisdom that I've had in all these years on the earth and uh, all the experiences I've had. And the only thing I can tell you is when you come out of this hall today, dance like nobody's watching because they're not. They're probably all checking their phones. Okay, congratulations, graduates, class of 2022. It's been my privilege to work with you and to be here today. All the best for your health, happiness, and the future. Thank you. <laughs>